I was born and raised in Liberia, in Africa, and I, everything around me was natural, nature, and uh, wood, and trees, and sand. So if you look around, you will see that everything is wood and rustic. I decided to move to Soho, which was a big step for me. I built my own stores with my own hands. I find the old wood and the antique pieces, and I put things together. This is the backstage of what we do and just a little taste. We have wedding bands, engagement rings, we do all kinds of stones. We also do white diamonds. We have a really wide collection for men and women. We can do a beautiful, simple tension ring. It's the pressure of the metal that holds the stone together. You can always add to it. So then you can see the diamonds on the outside while it doesn't take away from the stone itself. What we're really famous for is the wood collection and the key collection. It's hard to find a really cool wedding band that's uh, unique, that's still simple enough to wear. So these are some of our most successful wedding bands. A lot of men love to have a simple masculine wedding band. It's strong while it looks unique and stylish. I use bocote wood, as you see here, from Central America. It's a beautiful grain. We treat it for many months. It can be made in silver, gold, or platinum. It goes into pieces like this. We go to other steps, and that's our secret. You can see that we cut piece by piece and set it into a ring. And these are some of the finished pieces. The key collection comes from an original key from my childhood. There's myself and three of my brothers and sisters, and we each had our own little cupboard, uh, and that key happened to be in the door. So I decided to design a collection out of the key. There's design all over the watch, designs on the ring, on the side of the ring, designs on the black diamond. And if you would look into that detail in the key, you will find the same design on most of our pieces. I like me and my life uh, to be unique. I wanted to create something that's different than every other jewelry company out there. So as you can see, it paid off uh, after 20 years.